Okay, and welcome to a new series that Koala's gonna be playing. He's very excited to play this game. It's called Countless Rooms of Death. Pick it up on Steam for very cheap. Uh, I didn't start playing horror games, but uh, like at the beginning of, this, of the um, uh, uh, not the beginning of the um, of the channel, uh, Minecraft and League of Legends mostly, but. Um, I thought I'd branch out a little bit, try some new things. Uh, uh, well, I don't know if that sounds too loud or not. Also, like, what's going on with my height? Am I like five foot one or something? Ooh, needles. Can't do anything with those. Um, bottles, 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 bottles. Okay, so there's nothing in there. Ooh! Okay. So I can go through doors. They open up. Any of them? Um, okay. So... <coughs> we're gonna start going through... I assume this is like some terrifying horror maze. So we'll try this one first. Let's see what's on... Creepy. Is this dangerous? Okay, let me out. Let me out. Nope. Uh uh. Uh uh. No way. We're going a different way. Yep, we're going this way. Now, I love horror. Ooh. But I'm really bad at playing horror games. They freak me the fuck out. Like, really badly. Now, I was supposed to be playing this at night, but... Ooh. But... What the hell was that? Is this taking you back to the starting room? It does, okay. Alright. I need to... I should probably draw up a map. Or something. So I'm gonna get lost. I'm gonna be lost, terrified, and run, running, screaming. Barrels. What the fuck was that? Oh. Shite nuggets. I mean, like, you don't didn't see anything happening, but. What's that? Ooh, okay. Name Adam Chance, date of birth 30th of August 1975, blood type or blood group B, plus family B positive. Family members were informed. Wait, of what? Dispositions, no. Reception, train accident, victim, broken arm, right. Consciousness clear, internal bleeding could be stopped, lab, no abnormal values, condition stable, doctor's notes. Don't play any card games with this guy, he is a professional player, his arm was fixed and set, no psychological abnormalities can be released after a night under observation. Okay. Is that me? Is that who I am? Can't go through there. 
baseball bats. Can I pick up one of these as a weapon? I don't think so. Can't go through that door. Or that door. So I can only go back the way I came. Alright. I think this is the way I came. This is the path that leads to those freaky ass barrels, right? Yeah. Yeah, we ain't going that way. Uh-uh. What about this way? Okay, this is back to the starting room. Good. I like being in familiar places. Familiar's good. Familiar's good. I like it. Um, I'm trying to figure out, like, is this a map or something? Because... All these rooms have four ways. What's going on in here? Oh. Okay. So that's a key for that next room. So, all right. We're not going to worry about that right this second. in here. Same key. Can I go through this way? No, I can't go through that way. What about this way? Ooh, I can go through this way. Hmm. This is a dead end. Right, so my only choice is to go through here. So it's forward, left three, forward two, right. Okay. The, the hell did that come from? Two, forward. There's a bunch of needles on the ground. Duh! All right, all right. I'm satisfied. I'm satisfied. I'm. I'm done. I'm. No. I'm good. I'm satisfied. Woman's... Okay. Where's that coming from? literally coming from this chair. Ooh, what's that? Oh, name. Julia Morgan. Date of birth, 30th April 1975. Blood group A negative. Family members unavailable. Description, yes, organ donor card reception. Train accident victim. Again, base of skull fracture. No measurable brain activity recommended for organ transplant lab. No abnormal values. Condition, disease stable at the heart lung machine for organ removal. Doctor's comments. Had no chance to survive. Cranium almost completely destroyed, forwarded to the donor department. So who the hell am I? Okay, so... That's not me. Oh man, more symbols. Fuck. Fuck. Jesus Christ!
I don't think my heart can take this. But <laughs> this isn't even that scary of a game. There's a... There's a ghost of a dead woman here. I can tell it's a woman because she's got... Um... Glowing ethereal breasts. And there's a floating pipe. Press 1 for death, press 2 for life. 2! What do you mean? What? Name Elizabeth Merrill Johnson, date of birth 23rd March. Blood group AB positive, family members unknown, disposition unknown, train accident victim, massive internal bleeding, punctured lung, lab evaluation of blood levels unnecessary, condition deceased. Chest pierced by a broken retaining bar, right lung is collapsed, it looks like someone tried to resuscitate her, but he had no chance of success. Am I... Uh, okay then. Am I in purgatory? Is that it? Am I in purgatory? Did I die trying to save a bunch of people? This is exit. But there's bars not letting me out. Can't go that way. <coughs> I don't know how long this game is. As a statement, this game could be very short or very long. I don't know. I don't even know if I have the guts to finish this because my heart can't. I don't think my heart can take this. This is a new room. What's this do? Go through any of these doors? Yes? No? No. Alright, we come back to that room. Maybe. If my heart can handle this game. <laughs> like, it's it's not a scary It's really not a scary game. Yeah, this is not a scary game, but one, two, three, four, five. Four back one. One, two, three, four, five. Back one. Alright, where does this take me? Oh, just the screaming woman again. Now I'm curious what happens if I step on one of the other blocks. Oh, I burn! Okay, let me out. I get it. I get it. I died. Okay. All right. Okay, I saw that move. Guns, please. Guns, please. Guns, please. No. Let me out of here. Let me out. This is a lot of money or paper or something. It's just very big fake dollar bills. 
Very, very big fake dollar bills. Let me out of here. Let me out. I want to go home. I want to play Expender Bros. No, I'm done here. No more horror. Let me just leave and play Expender Bros. Or Minecraft. Anything, really. Just let me get. Let me leave. Please. Please. Wait. Um. This is different. Uh. No, it's the same. Uh, two, three, three, one. The hell does that keep falling from? that all right um you know I was planning on recording this and making a full series out of it but I just don't think my heart can handle that let's try death So, it's kind of a dead end room. What the? F Can I go through here now? No. Okay. Alright, I'm out. in these canisters and I don't really want to find out. <laughs> oh, it's just you again. Right? Yeah, it's just you. It's just you. It's the dead end room. Shut up. One, one, three, three. One, one, three, three. Son of a bitch! Alright, I get it. I died. Do I start back here at the beginning every single time? Come on, don't I get any hints or anything? the hell? Oh, that's creepy. 
Just like that. Wasn't that chair up? And where'd the other needles go? Alright, you know what? Okay, this game has successfully uh, made me decide that I'm okay with uh, uh, probably no horror games on the channel. At least played by me. At least played at night. At least played in the dark. Hopped up on sugar and soda, and yeah, we we we're gonna um uh well we're definitely gonna play more horror mo games, um but uh probably not under these exact same conditions, uh because this game is kind of terrifying when it's like two in the morning and you're sleep deprived and you're high on sugar and caffeine, and I'm just rambling because. Despite the fact that this game is not very scary, I am slightly terrified! And there's no reason why! There's no reason I should be terrified of this game. No reason at all. It... It relies on ambience, which is, I think, the best thing you can do with horror. Okay, these things are gonna fall. Big deal. I don't care. Still made me jump. That one won't open. This one won't open. That one won't open. Yep. Bunch of jump scares, don't care. Not not my Wait, I said I was gonna be done with this game. 